has everything that you might need. I would say that the company that wins is actually the funded trader. I have to give it to the funded trader. This is all for entertainment purposes only. Don't take any of this seriously. Come on, come on, man. You don't have the best track record in uh, recommending prop firms, but uh, let's look at your honest reviews in 2023. What were the best prop firms you recommended? I will make sure to say why all of these firms are ranked and where they are at. People in the comments are going to say, oh, but their slippage is so terrible. But again, my Forex funds is definitely at the top because again, most reliable. Every time I talk about me liking the funded trader, everyone comes after me because of the slippage and let me tell you i definitely have experienced the slippage but it doesn't bother me a lot and maybe like my perception is a little bit skewed because i'm already funded 600k with them oh yeah yeah right it's it's because you're funded 600k with them uh it's nothing to do with the amount of commission or or money you're getting no no can't be that you will never sell your soul for money. No way. You're doing sponsored giveaways and everything. What? It's me versus me. No way. No way. You would take any check from any company. No way. No way. It can't be possible. Kimo is the expert of the prop firms. He's the expert. He knows everything. He's the best. He's the best of the prop firm predictions and everything. He's so good. Maybe the reason I'm being a shill here is because it's the prop firm that I have the most amount of funding with. But in general, it really is one of my favorite ones. Let's listen to the prop firm expert, guys. We really need some help right now with the prop firm drama. So first is something that I think I personally came up with, but it's just a, a mathematical equation. So anyone could have come up with, which is the profit to drawdown ratio. You also have one of the lowest profit to drawdown ratios because a lot of people try to sell you on, hey, my prop firm is so much cheaper, but their conditions are terrible. Another thing to keep in mind is that they are also one of the cheapest in the industry, at least for the 100K. In the 10K, they are constantly running big discounts, like 40% off, 30% off their firms. So like the funded trader put like, like 30 40 percent discount codes on the 10k 5k challenges and the reality is because they know that most of the people that are going to fail are going for the 5k to 10k challenge ah now it makes sense yeah, yeah the profit to drawdown ratio oh yeah everybody knows that everybody's gonna fail the 5k and 10k challenges i did not he definitely for sure did not get this from the CEO of Funded Trader or somewhere else. No, no, for sure not. No way. It's not possible, guys. It's not possible. He just thought of this on his own. Yeah, he, he just thought of it. Oh, yeah, yeah, 5K, 10K are going to fail. That's why discounts, you know? Just simple. Everybody thought of that. Everybody knows that. Come on, it's basic logic. My Forex funds and the Funded Trader, yeah, both reputation is 9 for sure. 9 out of 10. Yeah, these two are like literally the best reputation. No slippage, really good for the traders. Yeah, they're the best. They're the best. You know what? The prop firm expert has convinced me. I will get an account with my Forex funds. Yeah, they they must be really good. Kimmel, Kimmel has recommended me to get one account with. <laughs> yeah, Kimmel, Kimmel, Kimmel has uh, convinced me to... Um... <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah yeah i think they're updating the system uh because they were so good that you know they're upgrading everything so lately everybody says that the funded trader is a scam and and this weird youtuber called marcus agent or something you know pointed it out like many times but you know kimmo kimmo is somebody i should really trust because he's never you know he would never sell his soul for money or anything like that no no he, i've never heard of him speaking badly about the funded trader so he must still be very much liking them yeah this is just some loser nobody that pointed everything out six months ago yeah he's nothing you know he's he's a loser he's only got eighteen thousand subscribers kimmel trading has like seventy three thousand subscribers he's obviously the expert in the field and not this guy so let me just follow him Let's buy a challenge with the funded trader. Yeah, this looks really good. This this looks amazing. This looks like, yeah, my path to uh, enlightenment and to uh, 
be able to be 1.5 million yeah this is amazing look at the a funded trader compared to other look they allow everything all these others are so bad fdmo no way funded next no way look we're the cheapest yeah like this is what i tell people if you're going for a firm you have to think about okay how are they going to make money from me or from anyone else mm. and so if there is a rule that seems so good to be true okay what's the catch because there is a catch on prop firms you know oh yeah yeah when a prop firm is like showing that they have so many that there is a catch yeah, obviously yeah that there's uh, you know yeah okay no but in all seriousness kimmel i know you have allegedly allegedly you have got over 100k in commission and look you recommended people to go to my forex funds all of them have lost their money they don't get a refund they may be funded whatever they're not getting their payouts and also the funded trader is not giving payouts banning people you've caused a lot of people pain and suffering don't you feel like you should maybe apologize for that that you made a mistake something like that no apparently not because you're not taking a check from anybody so yeah i mean you know it's you anyway man i wish you all the best and i hope dubai works out for you and uh yeah hopefully you have a little bit of better luck in the future with choosing the pro firms that you're affiliated with and listen man i have made some mistakes too like with crypto fund trader that was my really big mistake but straight away i told everybody that i got scammed and i warned everybody in multiple videos of how i got scammed and i switched up on prop firms as well like through forex funds and i have switched up on fund next as well so i do switch up i'm not a slave to the money i don't accept the checks just because I get money from them. I switch up on them if they're doing wrong things. And you are like a little bit young, so hey, it's all fine. You know, you make some mistakes, but hey, at least admit when you make a mistake, you know? It's human, we're, we're not robots, we make mistakes, but hey, maybe you can be a little bit honest about the funded trader. Everybody was telling you already from the beginning that my Forex funds and the funded trader had slippage issues and bad trading conditions, but you just decided to ignore them for some reason. So, hey, it's kind of on you a little bit. I'm sorry to say, but it is a little bit on you.